It's game it's four of the Eastern Conference quarterfinals. Glad you could join us today. Kevin Harlan here, joined by our analyst Greg Anthony and Hall of Famer Doris Burke. Plus, reporting from the sidelines, another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Hey, Dave. Thank you very much. Now, the calls to shorten the NBA season continue. One NBA president has even suggested a 58-game schedule. And for the playoffs, one and done. What's not to like? Everything, everything makes sense. Less the players, more practice time, and all the things you just talked about. Maybe DA, less is more. And thanks for the report. So a look at our starters for the Knicks. We've got Mitchell Robinson. Curry is out there with Clay Thompson. And it's Rudy Gobert, and it's Nurkic, and it's the police. And there's the call on Clay Thompson. That is his first foul of the game. Horford with a screen on Curry. Outside, Horford. Take a look at the Pacers. Greg, they have home court now. What do they need to do to take advantage of this opportunity? And Kevin, these are the games where I feel like you need to make big shots because the teams are close. One or two plays out of the way could decide this thing. That's why you have to value every possession early. Now here's Turner. Here's Brunson. Here's the pass to James. Six on the shot clock. Out of bounds. New York takes possession. Here's Thompson. First quarter of play. One minute played. Got a piece of it. Stolen by Brunson. to the free throw line for him in this one. At the line, from Indiana, Jalen Brunson, two shots. The first one falls for him. The way he's shooting free throws tonight, you simply don't want to put him there. Curry kicks to go big. Over Hofer. And to get open is Robinson. And James pulls it down. Just over a minute and a half played here in this one. Pass to Suggs. Indiana moving the ball over. A jump hook, and the rebound goes to the Knicks. They are still stinging from the loss on the first. Well, when you're facing a team that's feeding off the crowd's energy, you have to bring your A game. They didn't do that defensively. One thing you know, Greg, is you've got to pack your defense in the suitcase if you're going to win on the road, and they simply did not bring it. The Knicks have gone 0 3 from the field to start the game. Thompson in the post. Turner covering. Pulls it up. Shot clock reset for the Knicks. Master Robinson. Now here's Nurkic. Over Suggs. And Nurkic with the basket on the assist from Robinson. There it is. After four straight misses, finally nail one. And so James will bring it up for Indiana. Shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. It's going to be on Yusuf Nurkic. Always willing to embrace contact. LeBron James has the kind of frame that can absorb it any time. The Pacers have had two chances at the line already, making them both. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. A 
that free throw missing. It is really so impressive how LeBron James continues to play at a high level. We all respect greatness. What is the hardest thing to achieve is sustained greatness, and that's LeBron James. And he shakes the second. New York's gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Curry passes to Gobert. Right side Robinson. Thompson outside. A three ball. Again, the miss by Thompson. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. Here's Brunson. It's not going to go for him. Gobert with the defensive effort. Just under three and a half minutes gone here in the first quarter. This is it for Robinson. There's Nurkic. And he uses the glass on the lane. Boy, how about the awareness from the big man? We think of Mr. Robinson as a shot blocker. What a pretty pass. Horford with the screen on Nurkic. Here's LeBron. A quick back, and it's Horford with the extra effort. And that's a pure hustle play, getting to the offensive glass for the tip. And that's the kind of quality you see in any strong offensive rebounder. Either. Now, here's Thompson. No points in the game yet for him. Well, it doesn't hurt him on the interior. More than people realize, Clay Thompson gets those calls because of his willingness to put himself in tough spots. The next shooting their first shot tonight from the charity strike. good from Thompson. His contemporaries will say this. Blake Thompson's shooting stroke is as pure as it gets. And he makes both free throws. And here is James. Outside turning. The pass to Brunson. Into the lane, Robinson with the block. This guy is the host for the basketball, and his timing as a shot blocker is intimidating. Mitchell Robinson so quick off his feet. And that rejection had some mustard on it. Huge, huge play. And that block was something. It's the playoffs, and every possession and defensive stop matters. Nurkic against James. Walked again. Nurkic dishes the curve. Thompson in the corner. Pass to Nurkic. Curry with it. Shot clock at five. Buries it from three-point range. Well, you cannot let Seth Curry have room to shoot on the perimeter. You are asking for trouble. To Suggs. Oh, good that time. Good D by Thompson. New York win by four. This is to Robinson. New York moving the ball around. Curry outside. The rebound by Turner. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. Right. He stays connected and great timing on the contest. Now here's Turner. He's still scoreless so far in this one. They get it back. That's right, Horford. He kicks it to Suss. Back to Horford. Oh, and a chin by Horford. Going to find you pretty fast. On a AT&T 5G slam camp, you just saw an explosive highlight. Here's Thompson. Back to Curry. And to get open is Robinson. 
Gibson. Curry can't get it to go. Well, we didn't see the same kind of control we're used to seeing from him. This guy is usually a tremendous finisher. New York's gone one of five from downtown the first quarter. Points out there have been hard to come by. Picks it to Gobert. It's tipped. And here we go. Brunson heading to the hoop. Rips down the breakaway swing. And you can see the importance of that steal. Really a four-point swing with the conversion at the other end. Gobert with it. Goodbye, Suggs. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. LeBron kicks to Brunson. Horford sets a screen for Brunson. Does not score again. That's his fourth miss against one mate. Curry looking it over. To the middle. and gets it to go on the assist by Curry. And the Knicks lead by two. When you think of Seth Curry, you're thinking shooting. But there, what a pretty pass to find the open man. So the Pacers call timeout. Their first of the game. And some changes here for the Pacers. Huttenstein is checked in for Horford. Bay comes in for James. And Hart subbed in for Sarge. And a new group in for the Knicks. Lenz checked in for Robinson. JaVale McGee comes in for Rudy Gobert. Lamb is checked in for Yusuf Nurkic. Hardaway is subbed in for Seth Curry. Now here's Bay. Here's Hartenstein. Excellent D that time there from McGee. That is some tough defense there. Gets one of the better finishers in our game. Benson finds Hardaway. Thompson with it. Lamb with a screen on Hart. Thompson for the triple. The rebound by Turner. Turner's got his fifth rebound in this one. Boy, at some point, you've got to realize there might be a better option standing next to you. This guy has not made one basket in this period. Now here's Brunson. McGee with the block. Now Lamb passes it to Lamb. Defended by Hart. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that call string. He is trying to shoot his way out of it, and it might be better for him to pass the basketball at this point. And so here is Indiana after the miss from Clay Thompson. Here's Brunson shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. And I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. This is his second trip to the line in this one. Neesmith, he's checked in for Miles Turner. Boy, the wheels have definitely fallen off in this quarter. He cannot buy one. Thompson passes to Lamb. Lamb has a screen on Hart. Hardaway from outside. No good that time. And it's the Pacers taking it the other way. Bay with it. Picked up by Thompson. Now, here's Hart. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Brunson, no good. Let's give some credit to the defense for how they're guarding this guy right now because they're refusing to let him get comfortable. And Thompson kicks to Hardaway. New York, no good that time either. Indiana trailing here. Bay passes to Brunson. Now, Hart. Back to Brunson. There's the pick. Pulls it from the elbow. Well, for a big guy, so light on his feet, Len rising into the air with ease. Hart against Hardaway. Len with a screen on Hart. Going inside, and the dunk by Len. That's how you share the rock. He does this time and time again. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. The Pacers shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. And the first one. 
at the line. And both free throws good for Brunson. Here's Thompson. 158 left here in the opening quarter. There's the dish to Hardaway. Over Hart. It's rebounded by Hartenstein. Well, defenses are content to give up the mid-range, right? It's not the high percentage restricted area or the three. You can see they're prepared to give up that shot. Now here's Bay. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. Inside. Six to shoot. And he finishes nicely on the way. And the Pacers lead by one. And a nice job here early of establishing an inside presence. Brunson against Hardaway. Thompson high post. Over Neesman. The shot by Thompson, no good. Nothing seems to be going his way this quarter. Well, not at the offensive end, certainly. He cannot buy a bucket right now. Now here's Bay. McGee with the block. And he recovers it. Hard against Thompson. Lennox pull it in. They can trade two for one here. Would be the right move, I believe, right now. Right here. He loses from 15. Here's Len and the dunk by the win. Well, just terrific instincts right there from Alex Len on the offensive glass. Really impressive. There's 25 seconds left in the first quarter. Here's Brunson. The shot falls for only his second bucket and two for nine. Very aggressive in terms of looking for his shot. Nine attempts already, but only able to knock down two. Hard against Thompson. Outside Hardaway. Driving the lane, and it is good! And give him credit. Good awareness of the time remaining. And to me, the way you end quarters impacts how you end the game. It can go a long way between a W or an L. And a closely contested grit and grind first quarter comes to a close. Knicks out front, up one. The second quarter coming up right after this break, so don't go anywhere. And we welcome you back to game four on 2K Sports. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Knicks. And so far, they've been getting it done down in the post, outsmarting and outworking the defense to get their basket. And they've also shown dominance in the paint so far tonight, really putting the work in down low. We got this. LeBron James is out there with Bay. Then it's Josh Hart, and it's Turner in at the five. So that's the group out there for Indiana. I'll tell you, Tim Hardaway Jr. has shown signs of being a lights-out scorer, and he's got the game to do just that. He looks better and better every year, guys. Pacers trail by three. Here's Hart. Nothing in on the scoreboard for him. With the drive. Turner with the screen for Hart. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Tim Hardaway picks one up. And he's got his first free throw of the game. Can't get the first one. Well, pro probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that. Absolutely. Al Horford, he's checked in for Bay. And he's good on the second. The Knicks with the lead. And here is Hardaway. And the pass to Robinson. He dishes it to Kirby. 
It's rebounded by Indiana. Turner's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Here's James. Slammed home and he draws the foul. James for another point at the free throw line. It's going to be on Rudy Gobert. Now that'll give your team a jolt of energy. LeBron James, no doubt. This is his third free throw attempt of the game. Rudy Gobert, first personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for Indiana. LeBron James. One shot. One shot. Mind the lines. Mind the lines. One shot. One shot. Free throw good, James. And so Curry will bring it up for the Knicks. Knicks trail by one. Quarter number two. We're about a minute in. Robinson sets a screen for Hardaway. Solid play on the low block, and that one's good. Hardaway has got his second basket of the night. Just focusing on the task at hand. That's all we can do. Boy, the tide is running one way and then shifts back in the other direction. I've lost count of how many lead changes we've had here tonight. Nick shooting about 35% from the floor. Not much falling for them. Curry with the bounce pass. And there's Hardaway. That's good on the assist by Curry. Hardaway has got the lead up to four now for New York. LeBron against Grinch. Suggs with the ball. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Now, here's Curry. He's covered closely. Floats one. Two rebound by Turner. Turner's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Well, this is the night you look at your teammates and tap them on the back and say, good job, because for him, he's been struggling all night. Back to James. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. He's such a physical player inside. LeBron doesn't fear contact on the way up. This is his third trip to the free throw line in the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. No good on the free throw. Good on the second free throw. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half minutes played so far. Now Curry. Outside Hardaway. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Hardaway has gotten 12 points in the game. It just seems like the more he touches it, the more the lead grows. Pass to Turner. Now Hart. Turner with a screen on Hardaway. Hart the pass to Turner. Can't hit from in close. The Knicks leading by six. Three minutes of action so far in the second quarter. Curry gets to Nurkic. Outside Hardaway. Off the mark there with a three-point shot. Pacers have gone one three to start out the second quarter. Now, here's Sharp. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Gobert against Horford. And the Pacers can't get it to go. For New York, they've gone 50% from the floor in the second quarter, three of six. Outside Curry. Outside Hardaway. Shot clock at six. Go with a three. And a 
Tims Hardaway again missing. Pacers trail by six. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. I'm saying that's a nice job by LeBron to keep that ball safe and secure on his way to the cup. Robinson sets a screen for Cook. Pass to Robinson. Feeds to Nurkic. Down low. Here's Curry. And it's off the back rim. No good. Indiana's gone 0-2 from deep here in the second. Hart, that's good. What a pass from LeBron James. This guy just has a sixth sense for finding the open end. Now here's Curry. Outside Hardaway. New York, no good that time either. He's tried to get it going, but the shots simply have not been there. Nothing seems to be falling. And Horford wide open. He shoots. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. And now here's Nurkic. He'll bring it up for New York. Outside Curry. No good with the triple. Indiana trailing here. Hart kicks to James. And James throws it down. An aggressive move and fantastic finish. Mm -hmm. Trying to send a message with that slam, I think. And the Knicks decide to take their first time out here. And looking to stop this run and get back on track. Really needs to settle his guys down right now and get them refocused. So it's New York with it. Bobbed up there for Robinson. Trying to go for an alley-oop, but excellent defense and anticipation there to stop. LeBron with it. Now guarded by Nurkic. And LeBron throws it down hard. That is why the ticket price is what it is when LeBron is in town. Amazing dunk to finish the play. Here's Curry. Pass to Robinson. Dishes it to Hardaway. Trying to get something going. And again, it's the Knicks missing. No idea why he's attempting so many outside shots. It's not his day, and he needs to either look to drive or get it to an open teammate. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. Knicks trail by four. Outside curve. To the inside. Here's Nurkic. And the rejection by James. Wow, LeBron James sends it back emphatically. That was a message, folks. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. And he knocks down the first one. 
showing a lot more aggressiveness now after making zero trips to the line in the first quarter. And some changes here for the Pacers. Hartenstein's checked in for Miles Turner. Bay comes in for Al Horford. And it's Jalen Brunson in for Jalen Suggs. And a new group in for the Knicks. Lenz checked in for Robinson. JaVale McGee comes in for Rudy Gobert. Lamb is checked in for Yusuf Nurkic. And it's Clay Thompson in for Curry. Knicks trail by six. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. Hard away, no good. You can just see the frustration growing on their faces. Nothing going their way. It's just been one of those games, and they need to find a way to turn it around before it gets completely away from them. Nice play, and you can see their gathering momentum. You want to continue to build on this lead. Right now, still a little too close for comfort. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. He's ready. He's checked in for Indiana. Thompson outside. The pass to McGee. Out to Lamb. They need this. A three-pointer is right on target. Lamb's got himself on the board with three there. And I like how he draws the attention on the inside and then the nice little kick is in the job. Brunson against Hardaway. That's too hard. For three. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Land's got six rebounds now in the game. Thompson lays it up off the glass. And now just a three-point Indiana lead. Well, Thompson is getting increasingly difficult to stop on the dribble drive. When he gets hit, he stays with the play. Hartenstein passes to Bay. And he drives in. Some solid defense there from Land. And so it's Thompson with it. Bring it up for the Knicks. No good. That would have tied it. And another miss. Oof. He's having a really ugly game. Yeah, about as ugly as you can have. You're right. To Brunson. To the paint. Here's Hartenstein. A shot to get on the assist by Brunson. And the Pacers lead by five. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. Here's Hardaway. He takes it in, and he drops in the way up off the glass. Hardaway has got 14 points. Well, this quarter has been all about this guy. He is trying to close the gap in the score. Pass to Brunson. Gets that one to drop. A rear make, bumping him up to three for ten. And now you see them starting to really work the ball inside. Hardaway sets a screen for Thompson. Gets it to fall, but still just two for ten from the four this game. Boy, beautiful shot off contact. That is what you get with a bigger guard like Clay Thompson. Back to Brunson. And here's Bay. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Bucket six. Passes it to Neesmith. Here's Brunson. Misses the three. Knicks trail by three. Taps it outside. On the pass to McGee. Here's Len. And that one is good. He's got six. The broad shoulders of Alex Lynn carrying more of the load inside. Now, here's Neesmith, guarded by McGee. Hard against Thompson. Hart the pass to Hartenstein. left in the first half. Pass to Len. New York needs to get off a shot. McGee's shot is off. And uh, Indiana 
was shooting very well, 56% from the floor here in the second quarter. Across to Bay. Down low. And he floats in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. And they've had assists now in their last three baskets. Passes to McGee. Len with it. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. This is called getting a better understanding of the game. How and when to attack. Len going to the free throw line. Hey guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Pacers? And right from the jump, they've been working hard to establish themselves inside, using agility and power to get shots in the paint. You know, also, they've been incredible on the fast break, taking those chances, playing with great pace. Both free throws, good from Len. Well, still working to become a more accurate free throw shooter. And what you like about Len is he's getting to the free throw line a lot more consistently. Now, here's Brunson. He's got 11. Here's Bay. It's rebounded by New York. Lane's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Thompson misses the Hardaway. That's in, coming off the assist from Thompson. Hardaway has got 17 now. I'll tell you, this guy is proving to be a problem for the defense. In this quarter, he has been special. Indiana moving it around. Bay, no good. Thompson surveying the floor. The tray. The shot, no good. It's been all about Tim Hardaway for New York. Just going to get going to him again and again. And he delivered with a master quarter. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much. Coach, this team is still developing. What do they need to do to really reach their max? Just keep working every day. Get maximum effort, great concentration, and play the win. Make winning plays. Sounds simple, but I know it's not, Coach. Thanks for your time. Back to you guys. All right, David, thank you. And stay with us, folks. We'll be back just after halftime to get the third quarter started.